be our new accountant. Finally, yeah, I hope you like your new accounting office. Yeah, I was super excited about the accounting work you'll be doing. Yes, yes, this is splendid. Yeah, we've been without an accountant for far too Can't long. Can't get anything done without an accountant. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, things have been a mess around here. We have no idea where we are with the finance. Can't trust the numbers without an accountant. All right, well, enough of the pleasantries. Let's get you all situated. All right. Pop open the cartridge slot there on the desk. On the desk. Pop it open. Push down on it. And it will pop open. It will pop open. Pop open the cartridge slot. Push it to pop up. that thing. All you have to do is push down on it, and it'll spring up out of the desk. It's, it's grey it's with a red bit in the middle. Yeah, push it up. Pull it up, something. So it's on the table. It's on the table. And it's <laughs> grey and it's red. It's on both of those things. So if you push that down, it'll pop on up. The table. There might be some things on the table, but you can move it all off. You can figure that fucking out. Oh, good. Pretty much. Well. <laughs> cartridge slot built right in the accounting desk. That's what you'll see a picture of in the dictionary if you look at the word efficiency. Well done. Put the cartridge in the slot now, please. Right, right, this is all right. Finally. So, in a moment, your <laughs> VR goggles will pop out of the deck. Any moment now. Anticipate it. Oh, it's the newest craze in accounting. VR accounting is the new thing. It's the newest <laughs> craze in accounting. Virtual reality accounting. It's in, in the desk and it'll come out any time Your now. accounting speed will be dramatically increased by the use of these virtual reality goggles once they pop up out of the deck. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? But hey! Hey, don't touch that! That's my birdhouse! That's my little birdhouse! Fuck you! You're ruining my whole place! Get out of here! That's my bird thing! That's where that's my birdhouse! Don't touch my birdhouse! This is my tree world! This is my tree place! Hey, no, don't touch these goggles! Those are my goggles! Put it back! This is my stuff! You're taking my That's a seed, isn't it? Hey, that's my seed! Don't touch my seed! Hey, don't hey, don't put my seed in the dirt! It's all dirty and gross now! You ruined my seed! You put my seed in the dirt! It's all dirty and gross and sick now! <laughs> okay, I like this a lot. Listen, bitches. We're the toughest motherfuckers around. You got that? Yeah, that's right. We eat dicks for breakfast. Don't we? That's right. Don't we? You said it, man. Oh, that's yeah. right. That's right. You said it. That's right. Child. Child. Yeah. That's right. We eat dicks for breakfast. <laughs> fucked up things mm -hmm. all throughout the night. All right, Scooter. Yeah. You gotta prove how fucked up you are to us, all right? Prove it to us, homeboy. Prove how fucked up you are if you want to. Oh, whoa, whoa. Scooter drank the adult oh, beverage. Scooter drank it. Wow. <laughs> yeah, but it's still not cool enough to be part of our game. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
I've done everything. <laughs> oh dear. Whoa. Hello. Who are you? I am so glad to see you. Thanks for being here in my dungeon. I don't know who you are, but I'm so miserable and lonely by myself. I'd like you to stay forever. Please. Please hang out so we can chat about just nonsense and whatnot and all the fun stuff. So let me tell you about my day. I woke up, I took a big poopy shit, and then I just went around the house, just walking around, just walking <laughs> around this dungeon of mine. Just not to, I don't have much, this is why I'm sitting down right now. This is why, this is why I'm laying here. Hey, no spoilers. I'm the king in, of this whole place and I eat everything. And I eat everything and I don't poop for a day. And you caught me on the day that I pooped, so I'm finally exhausted today, and I sat down, I pet some stuff that I, like, had stuffed animals that I collect in my other room, you can't see them, but, uh, you're gonna see them later. But you have to just, if you hung out with me every day, and while I eat, see, I eat a lot. Ah, uh, right. And if you hung out with me, we could, we could both talk about the, what I'm eating, like, <laughs> This is crazy good. That's very good. Special coin. There's lots of special coins. Whoa! Whoa, okay, okay, okay. So, you're interested in the secret zero level? Uh, <coughs> okay. Alright, this is what I'm working on at the moment. It's the special, you know, the. Uh, okay, gather around, go around, eyes front. <sighs> this is the grand secret zoo level conspiracy by me. I've collated all the evidence, I brought, it, I brought it all here in one place, and we're gonna go over it now. And we're gonna get to the bottom. I'm gonna help me, you're gonna help me get to the bottom of where this fucking secret zoo level is. You're gonna be real important in this process. You're gonna hit the slides for me, okay? You're gonna press next on the slides. So, this all began at the Game Awards. Uh, Jeff Keighley interviewing Justin Roiland and William Pugh. Got the transcript here. <coughs> you see, Keighley brings up the secret zoo level. Uh, a lot of hard work went into it, a lot of hard work for a very small sliver of the fans that will be able to find it. Incredibly difficult to find. <laughs> And here's the most important part. They say clowns in the level. Clowns. And they say that I I came from there. I don't remember being in the secret zoo level. Maybe they wiped my memory. I don't know what the fuck's going on. The next slide. Next slide. Come on. So this is me. This is me. Uh, this is me from the trailer. You see, I'm, I'm, I, 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 this is the alleyway at the back of my, back of my apartment complex. Uh, uh, and, uh, and, and I think what they did was they, they hooked up a sign as a red herring outside my, my, my apartment uh, that said zoo entrance to try and fuck with people. So I went back out there last week, took it down, uh, analyzed it. There's four screws on it. Maybe that means something. I don't know. I'm writing everything down at this point. It's right here. It's, you, you, you pick it. There's a... Uh, Okay. <clears throat> Next slide. In fact, fuck it. I'm doing the slides now. 
right. So then oh, a couple of weeks later, they did the launch trailer, all right? And they said, if you pause it right at the end, they say, does ship with secret zoo level. They wouldn't fake that. It would be false advertising. Next slide. Justin Roiland said 24 hours to find the secret zoo level. Will you be here in six months? Ugh. Ah, and then they sent out another email. This is where it gets deeper. It gets deeper, okay? Because they sent out this email, and then next slide, in that email they had a code. They had this code with all these different numbers, and you decode that, and it provides more numbers. And then next slide, then you've got this. Then, then it goes all down to this deeper search clown ass password, and we don't know what that means. Uh, and then we got more, we got more, we got more secrets, and then we got more, more codes. And so look further down, the secrets are levels inside all of us. Three, 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 nine, one, two, four, one. Ah! Oh. And so I think maybe, okay, let's get back to the beginning, okay? So I go to Clovis, I'm like, Clovis! Hello? <laughs> Can I get the ball in the hoop? What are the statues? Okay, up there. So I go down. Trying to throw things in the office cabinets because William Pugh said in an interview that there was a secret if you got the thing in the cabinet. And then I'm checking, I'm checking the tree level. I'm throwing things over the hills, throwing them over the hills, and I'm, try, I'm just trying. You know, I hear the sounds. There's maybe an elephant, maybe the secret zoo level's there. And then I'm down, I'm going down, and then I'm in the king room. I'm in the king room, and there's a secret invisible item in there. Do you think the developers would just leave a secret? item that's invisible in there they know about that that's for a reason none of this is random this can't be random this is going to add up to something there's going to be a reason for all this it's clearly they were thinking of something they had some process at work while they were making these hints these clues <sighs> what's that key up there if you want my advice if you want my honest advice forget you saw any of this None of this means anything. You're not going to find the secret zoo level. It might as well, for all practical purposes, not exist. This room, I mean, I mean, this room, conceptually speaking, is probably cooler than anything that the developers could have made for the secret zoo level. But, uh, <coughs> uh, <coughs> anyway, there's. It, there's two pills. Uh, take either one. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't matter. Take it. They're in the cabinet. Under the TV. So what's the key up there? By the window. Take either one. I kill you. Take you back to the rest of the game. Ah, oh, just enjoy it. Just enjoy it for what it is. I'm out of here. I'm going now. Blimey. Unless you come back to this room, in which case I'll probably forget any of this has ever happened and I'll repeat exactly what I've just said verbatim. Oh. Between that saying. Uh, any of these meta jokes do anything for you? No. Hit it. it nothing. Meta, meta, meta joke about the whole, the whole process. This is probably going over most people's heads. Alright, welcome uh, back to Level Wars with, uh, with me, me Swampy Cornelius. So, is, you know, I'll be doing what I always you know, do, you know, which is you know, bringing you the truth. Hoping that someone, uh, anyone, will hear me cough. and see the truth before their very uh, eyes. Uh, uh, we need them to wake up. We gotta wake uh, up! Uh, I am fine. sick of these goddamn developers pulling the strings, sending us on some wild goose chase they call the secret zoo level. And I am sick uh, of all these coffee. gamers, all these fake gamers in the forums uh, uh, being all like, Ooh, look at me, I'm closer to finding the secret level. I'm gonna be the one who... Do that for a couple of hours. Ah, oh, and it'll be long, it'll be as still as long as Resident Evil. Jeez, Umbrella! You know, it's raining! That's what they call gameplay, picking things up, dropping them. Motherfucker, 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 so you can just just find the pills, eat one of the pills, red or yeah. it doesn't matter which one. It does seem oh, odd to me. Bad mood now. I'm sad here. That there's a key up there. Justin Roiland with about William Pugh hopping about like ah, this old powerful scum. Hi ah, William Pugh. Should we just take a pill. How does six months fighting the secret zoo level sound up? Huh? Roll up. <laughs> Very intriguing. That's not hey, freaky, is it? Hey, come here. Come here and play us. Hey, bro. You 
want to get up in here and play this, this, these bones? Man, you a kid. Come, come here and play me. Play me really hard. I want you to pick up those sticks. <laughs> right, I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching. This. Oh, fuck off. I should have brought a cable coin with me. Look. Is there a coin in there? Should have bought a coin. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Wait, 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 wait.